Good morning, Hamilton. I'm so excited to see you here today for a wonderful day of working hard and being kind. Today is Thursday, February 15th. Let's go ahead and get started. We have some birthdays to celebrate today. So um, today is Nora's birthday, Miss Shoemaker's room. Happy birthday, Nora. Also over the weekend, we have Angel's birthday in Miss Kinser's room. And it's also going to be Elizabeth's birthday in Ms. Morrow's room and Liam Roadcap's birthday in Ms. Mauer's room. Oh, hold on. We got a couple more this weekend. We also have um, William Alter's birthday in Ms. Weigel's room and Tiago's birthday in Ms. Morrow's room as well. Ooh, busy weekend. That's very exciting. Okay. I also have been forgetting to announce that last weekend, our boys basketball team had their had their semifinals and they made it. The fifth grade A team made it to the semifinals, which is really great. We're really proud of you boys. They, um, they were defeated by Crestview, but they still made it to the semifinals and they were working their hardest there. And we were super proud of what you guys did. So good job. Um, I also, we have our vocabulary word, inform. To tell someone about a topic by giving them the facts. And our winner this week is Amani in fourth grade. She wrote, inform means to tell someone or to let them know about a fact. Excellent job. Good work, um, Amani. We'll make sure Ms. Muster gets you your prize. Okay, and we have our core essential for this month, kindness. Showing others they are valuable by how you treat them. And our animal this month is the very sociable weaver, a small, unassuming bird in Southern Africa. The sociable weaver creates an amazing home sweet home. Sociable weavers make huge nests that resemble hanging haystacks, which is pretty cool. One rambling nest might house up to 100 families with room for the next generation of, of birds. When babies hatch, their older siblings help to feed them. Sociable weaver parents even feed insects to babies that don't belong to them. Survival rates for these chicks is higher than for chicks raised by their parents alone. So the sociable weaver is a great animal to represent kindness because they work together. They help each other out, not because they have to, but because they want to. And that's what we do when we show kindness. Okay, tomorrow there is no school for students. Teachers have some meetings we're going to be doing. And um, on Monday, we are going to be doing our a flexible instruction day at home. So that means you're going to stay at home on Monday and you're going to do seesaw assignments on Monday. iPads are going home with you today. You need to make sure you use your iPad for your school work, right? Making sure we're using them appropriately, making sure we're using that technology tool and understanding this is, a, this is something the school gives me. This is something that I need to make sure I'm using the right way, I'm being responsible with, and that I can be trusted with what's expected of me. That's what we talked about with responsibility. So I hope everyone's making those good choices and then bringing those iPads back on Tuesday. So I hope you all have a nice long weekend. You'll have four days at home, one of them being that flexible instruction day. All right, have a great day of working hard and being kind to make today as great as you are. And at this time, please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance.